What's up, channel? Limitless here. Uh, got a uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 2 competitive scrim game uh, uh, This is my team, Enemy high points, a. against uh, I don't know what they would this, this scrim is actually a couple weeks old, uh, to be honest with you. But uh, this is Enemy Domination Bravo Slums, and uh, yeah, my team here does pretty Bravo. well. Uh, this, is, this is actually the first scrim we ran. And I'm very behind on my videos, and I apologize for that. But I have a whole stable of videos coming through. Um, yeah, we've got a lot of scrims I've been running. I've been playing pretty well in scrims. And uh, so basically, we're going to kind of channel, we're going to show our progression here on my channel. Um, I've got, this is the first time I've ever played MLG variant on Call of Duty. Normally, it's just search and destroy, but on this game, and they want to go all in. Um, the team wants to go all in, so we're going to be playing uh, MLG variant, which consists Losing of domination, B. search and destroy, capture the flag, Losing and now hard. So it gives a variety. Um, I like the variety. Uh, to explain what's kind of going on here, uh, we are playing domination, essentially trying to just hold these two flags and keep the other team spawning down at the bottom of the map. So it seems like I'm kind of camping here a little bit. Kind of am. But, uh, you know, I do make some decent plays in this game. I also make some mistakes in this game. Uh, like I said, this was my first script, and since then I've definitely learned a lot. I learned a lot by watching the videos myself before I upload them. Uh, like here, I just need to play my role and just really watch this left side. That needs to be my job, and, you know, I've been fortunate enough to pick up a lot of kills here, but at the same time, I really should stop cheating over. Um, I'm also noticing now I've only got 24 bullets left in my gun, and I'm going to need to pick up something. So, I go over here, and he's got a gun that I don't really like. And I go back over here and realize there's a PDW there. So now I'm dancing around trying to find it again so I can pick it up, yet at the same time not get killed. So, um, but anyway, uh, just to kind of update a little bit what's going on. Like I said, we're playing... Uh, playing Black Ops 2 pretty much exclusively these days, uh, scrimming a lot of nights, um, and just you know trying to get better, trying to get ourselves ready to play in game battles and to play in tournaments and whatnot. Actually, I have a couple gameplays ready to upload, um, so I'm just kind of doing them one at a time here. And uh, like I said, this being our first scrim, I wanted to post it first. Um, I was fortunate enough to get that kill while I was stunned, which is always good. Uh, and our our plan here is working out well. We've got these two flags, and they can't seem to penetrate us. And I think I do make a mistake here at some point. But uh, you know, we've got we've basically got the map locked down, and that's what you want. And I get stunned again. <laughs> the stuns on this game are so powerful. Now lucky to get that kill. But you, you stay stunned forever, and they, they seem to be more crippling than in past games. Now here's where I make a mistake. I go across, all the way across Crafty, who's controlling the middle of the map. Didn't really need to do that. Could have stayed right where I was. And, uh, fortunately, it, it didn't bite me that time. But, it may have been, may have resulted in my demise there. Because I could have, um, if I'd have stayed there, I don't know if I'd have walked around and went back to where that nade was. So anyway, live and learn, and I come back. Um, throw a stun there to see if anybody, somebody's coming. Kind of get right back to my spot. He had the head glitch there. That wasn't really a good idea for me to challenge that gunfight, but it was also a little bit of poor timing. Um, there's Beyond's nade. That thing is awesome. <laughs> see, he threw that nade over there and landed right on B and got that kill. <laughs> so... I'm trying to get myself back in position. I feel like we've kind of lost control a little bit, even though we still have the flags. Uh, Crafty's back now in his spot. There's a guy around here, Beast. I almost got him. Unfortunately, it doesn't happen. He gets a kill. We've only got about 25 seconds till halftime. Losing Bravo. Which is good because they just got B. Because, you know, now with it being halftime, we don't have to worry too much about. Losing map control, we can try to establish it again next round. So, this is actually really good timing. If you're going to lose it, you want to lose it towards the end of that first round. And it gives you a chance to recompose yourself in the second. Good 
job, Grunts. Get ready so, for the next round. Start out 10 and 3. I actually struggle a little bit more here in the second half. Um, I wanted this video to be a listen in. I'm actually good. We've got a couple of those ready to go where you can hear our communication. Uh, hopefully, that's something that, that, everybody, that you guys will enjoy watching and everything. Um, and Dominate. before I forget to plug it, uh, we, have, we have a team YouTube objectives. channel. Um, it's securing YouTube.com, obviously. Securing it's High a. Point MLG. That's H I G H P O I N T M L G. Enemy all run together, no spaces or anything. We've taken the lead. Um, so. Securing B. We're able to push secure. The, the B. See, what I like to do in a situation like that where I'm passing the flag is I, I don't cook the nade, I just throw the nade through the graveyard there because it sits. The nade just sits there and they won't come in that whole time. So that gives us time to cap the flag while the nade's laying there as an indicator on their screen waiting to blow up. And uh, whereas if I cook it, yeah, I would risk the chance. I may get a kill out of it, but then that second guy might come through again. Um, now what we're trying to do from this side is we're trying to push through. The top spawn is actually the better spawn. What we'd like to do is push through and flip the spawns to where they spawn at the bottom and we spawn at the top so we can lock it down like we did last round. Looks like I got a little frame right here. Bravo. Okay, there we go. I'm back. I don't know if the video skipped for you guys, but it did skip for me a little bit in recording here. I'll see if I can clean that up before I put it out. But we lost Alpha. So in this situation, we weren't really sure what the spawns were. It looked like the spawns flipped, but there was that one guy that was still up top, and he caught me in the back. And I wasn't really paying attention. So but now it's like we got the spawns flipped. They're trying to take me from us. We have to make sure that doesn't happen. I killed, just killed Crafty there with a nade. But uh. So now we've got things back to where we want it, where it belongs here. And, uh, you know, we can hopefully coast to victory. Uh, we the setup going as I get ripped. So, I was just losing the gunfight. Wasn't much I could do. I you know, did the best I could with that. Um, but Crafty, who is just an outstanding slayer on our team, uh, was able to basically control that whole middle area by himself. Um, I do play more objective roles on this team, where, which comes with running flag, carrying bomb, and searching, capping flags, and whatnot. You know, Call of Duty has always been known for having uh, big time, being big on roles that are played. Beyond with that nade again on B, he loves that. Um, so, and I take the objective role. Because, you know, for example, there I'm not the greatest shooter in the world, but I do know routes. I do understand spawns. You know, it does I I do get around the maps really well. Securing B. So there's uh, there's me not cooking down. another nade. So again, guy's coming up the ramp there from that bottom spawn. He's gotta stop and get away from the nade, or not like he just did and die. <laughs> so So but anyway, this game's in the bag pretty much in the bag here. We're holding down these two flags. Uh, be a lot more coming, more scrim gameplay, game battles gameplay coming. Losing um, Bravo. Yeah, I've gotten a lot better since this video, and uh, I look forward to uploading more gameplay so you can see that. And hopefully, you guys watch the growth of our team and check out our team's YouTube channel too. And uh, you know, just enjoy the content. Hopefully, we'll get better and all that good stuff. So looks like the video is going to be winding down here in the next minute or so. Uh, is there anything got, you guys want to see? Uh, you know, definitely post in the comments. Um, I'll do my best to oblige. And um, yeah, I do thank everybody for watching, for sticking around my videos, and sticking around through my lack We're of videos, I should fight. say. And uh, that's pretty much it. And thanks everybody for watching. I am out. Losing B. It's too close. Fight harder. Losing Bravo.
big win, job done. <laughs>